The first four minutes of this video starts off quiet. There's no sound for the moments before an incident at the center of a federal lawsuit. Nine News obtained body camera video of what happened at an elementary school in Cheyenne, Wyoming last year. The complaint says a school resource officer physically assaulted this eight-year-old boy with a neurodivergent disability. He's talking to his principal at the table. That's all you can see. And what happens next is difficult to watch. There's a very sharp edit cut in the video. The child is screaming on the ground with the school resource officer on top of him. You cross your legs right now. We don't know how this happened or why. The lawsuit claims the SRO deleted portions of his body camera video in an effort to conceal his wrongdoing. No. No, no, you don't get to win this now. It's all me. Do you understand me? Before this happens, the complaint says the principal and a teacher were talking to the boy about his behavior at lunch. They didn't ask the SRO for help, but when the child tried to walk away, the lawsuit says the SRO grabbed the boy's arm, took him into a conference room, and slammed his face onto the floor. After this happens, the boy's father comes to the school. So I don't understand why you're putting your hands on him if you will be hurting anyone. Because as a law enforcement officer, that's my primary function. Yeah, as the awesome. student seems to try to catch his breath, the SRO tells the dad he put the boy on the ground after he kicked a chair and fought back. And he also got a, small, a bloody nose. He tried biting my hand. Um, and then I'd put his face on, you know, face down on the ground. The lawsuit says the SRO violated school policies and the boy didn't do anything wrong that required use of force. Fight me again. Fight me again. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.